What's up you guys? It is Lumi here and I wanted to get on here today because I haven't been on my YouTube channel in quite some time. Um, I have basically been dealing with the same thing that everyone around this world has been dealing with and also trying to uh, finish up school, which is right around the corner. Um, I actually graduate next month. <laughs> so um, that's just very, very surreal for me. Um, and also match day is coming up very soon. And um, we have like 20 days left or something like that. It's March 15th is match day. And then March 19th is where you actually find out where you're going uh, to start your training. So it's a lot of exciting things that are coming up. Prayerfully, prayerfully, I match. Um, I will post a video, you know, uh, once that happens. Um, but what I wanted to talk about is, what I wanted to talk Can about is, um, no, I'm doing something. Can I, I'll be out in a second. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. Also homeschooling my children. <laughs> but um, the last video that I posted here was basically talking about, you know, am I going to graduate and, um, you know, what had, what, I was anticipating where I was trying to apply for match and all that. I'll make sure I post that uh, a link to it so you guys can kind of like get that prior to maybe watching this video because this is kind of like a continuation of that. Um, but you know, yes, I am going to graduate. That was one of the first questions that I, I got after that video. So I am going to graduate. I have a set graduation date. We are not having a um, actual ceremony because of everything that's going on. So things will be virtual, but you will receive your diploma in the mail and all of that. So that's good. Um, and yeah, you know, after that, then it's uh, going to my residency training prayerfully. And so that's where I am. Um, after that video, I had a lot of things that I needed to finish up. And so I had to do i think i was in my inter my internal medicine uh, rotation i'm not really sure but after that i definitely did a sub eye i did a couple of sub eyes which are rotations um that you're kind of treated like an intern and so i decided to travel um and go and do a sub eye uh with a hospital in uh new jersey I was there for like a month and um, that was a very good experience for me because, you know, one reason why I chose to do that is because I wanted to get just some more hands-on experience on, you know, trying to figure out what I wanted to do um, because I have been torn, I have been torn in between obstetrician, gynecology and family medicine. Um, and that is like, you know, really what I'm trying to, been trying to decide on what I wanted to do. And so I ended up applying to both specialties and wanted to see where the cards would fall. Um, and I did get a lot of interviews um, during that time. So I ended up getting five, only five OB interviews, but I ended up getting like a massive amount of <laughs> family medicine interviews, um, which was not normal. Right. This was a very uh, different type of interview season because everything was virtual and, you know, you were able to take a lot of interviews because you did not have to travel. And so I ended up being one of those people initially taking all the interviews that I could possibly get. And then, you know, thinking about it more and, um, you know, not wanting to just take interviews just to have them. Right. So I had to really think about if, if this was like, if I got this interview, would I have traveled there? Or is this a place where I would actually want to go and practice or train? And, you know, once I really did that, I ended up um, denying or declining about 10 interviews. And so that hopefully gave 10 people a chance to get an interview that might not have had an interview. So. That's what I did. That was my approach. But in total, I got about 31 interviews, um, including OB, family medicine. And I also uh, had internal medicine as well because I applied internal medicine too. So I'll do a video on, you know, 
why I applied, you know, so many <laughs> different specialties and all of that. But um, I just wanted to update you guys because I hadn't been on here. And um, just to let you know, I will be coming back very soon with more videos. Um, you guys can leave in the comment section what you want me to record that would help. Um, and I can make videos according to that. I do do a lot of stories on IG with my daily life. So if you guys want to keep up with me, make sure you follow me on other social media platforms like Instagram. Um, I'm not really on Facebook so much, but definitely Instagram. I'm on there like a lot. Um, and I also go live on there sometimes. It just really depends on, you know, what's going on. I don't do it very often, um, but I have gone live on there. And I find that actually really convenient for me because I can just go live and whoever wants to join in can just join in. So if you guys want to do stuff like that too, just let me know. Um, but I am going to be documenting my residency experience and journey and all of that. So thank you guys for following me. Thank you for still supporting me. And yeah, it's almost there. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.